Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Nuclear Throne Ultra. We're jumping in again. We're going to randomize our character and we get Atom. Now that we've randomized, I know this is kind of stupid, but I'm going to quit back to the main menu so that I can then just check my settings as Atom. I will let that decide and then we'll make sure we're on uh, random here and uh, crown and then we'll go back in and then we can choose this bad boy. As I said before, I want to try and use this crown more so that we can... Uh, Play around with trying to get our rads really quickly. It also makes me play more cautiously. As this guy, we do get a pretty sexy little teleport where we can teleport around through walls and stuff. But actually pretty pretty gnarly for melee, to be honest. I quite like it for melee. Um, open mind, probably, early on. Open mind could be pretty good. Yeah, go, doing stuff like that is really nice. Remember, these guys are going to do, a, like, 6 HP of damage on hit. Uh, thrown butt. Upon teleportation, fire an explosive laser towards um, your previous position. Cause plasma and lightning at destination. That's different than it was before, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think it used to just be an explosion. I didn't think it was, like, specifically elemental before. Leveling up pretty quick though so far. And Puffy Cheeks is probably pretty good here. Bouncy Fat would be nice too. Apparently Eagle Eyes on the Shovel is a, is a direct downgrade. It actually lowers the amount of damage it deals. So thank you guys for telling me that. Because I, I was completely unaware of that being the case. It's kind of silly that it is the case. But apparently it is. I can destroy walls with this thing as well, which is kind of nice. Good, good, good. Um, last wish seems good. Wasn't quite ready for the assassin there. Yeah, the teleporting is super... It's, it's risky, but it's super nice. Getting through these tight hallways. I was hoping I could blow that wall up there with the shooting the fire, but couldn't quite get it. Cool. Yeah, I'm liking the setup. I'm liking the setup a lot. I did just get hit for a, quite a bit of damage there. Got the purple boys as well shooting me. Don't like Mr. Snipey Snipey trying to get me here. It's rather annoying. Got some extra HP there. Oh, Assassin. Thank God we got Last Wish going on. Dude, that guy. Oh, no. He didn't die in a single hit, you little... You little fucker, man. You little fucker. This run's pointless now. Fuck's sake, I'm just gonna go kill myself in here. That's really annoyed me, that as. He didn't die in a single hit. He like he was supposed to. That guy didn't die in a single hit either. Y'all need to die quicker. Oh my god. You're all so strong. Fuck off. Oh my lord. I don't know. Thrumbutt seems like interesting with this character. It's kind of hard to use effectively, especially with double damage on. But it seems interesting. Like, good though. Right through here we go. Um... Last Wish early on just seems like a good idea. I need to take Last Wish way more often, to be honest. Yeah. 
Yeah, I need to just use this for getting around. Make sure I don't miss out on rads, though. That's kind of stupid. Nice. Cool. Go through here. Um, this is pretty good. Rocket Clap was good last time. I liked that. It seems way better than Quality Zero, in my opinion. Maybe it has a chance to hurt myself or something? I don't know. Look at that. That was beautiful, that. Okay, I think I did hurt myself with it there. Oh, hello. Spawn right on me, why don't you, big boy? Too many maggots. Oh, man. No, if that happens that early on, it's just, just restart. <laughs> these weapons are not even nearly good enough. I need to get some more golden weapons to this guy, because these weapons are not even nearly good enough for these early floors. On a double damage. We're just not, not killing things quick enough. We're not killing things quick enough at all. Kraken Pistol isn't going to cut it. There you go. Um, but I mean, with Bolt Marrow, then maybe it's going to be better. I think it'll do a bit more damage on average with Bolt Marrow. Screwdriver there. I'll take Screwdriver for the, uh, the car. Because that can give us more golden weapons. Hopefully we can get open mind before then to get even more golden weapons. Making sure we get a full amount of rads. Like, yeah, it's just not enough, is it? Toxic launcher. So many toxic weapons as well. That's another thing that's kind of annoying. So many toxic weapons coming our way. Cool, I'm going to stay out of the way of that. Oh my! <sighs> I did not expect to just see an alley. Okay, do you know what? Quickly, um, quickly quit back to main menu. We are going to go and put on the flare gun permanently because the flare gun is just a god tier starting weapon. It's so much better than any of the other ones we have available to us right now. It just has so much ways of dealing damage and it has such good AoE and stuff. It's like the potential of it's so high. We cannot ignore. Um, Stack Fists. That's one other thing I need to take more. 35% extra damage. If you pair that with like Scary or Fierce, it's, it's pretty mad how much damage we can do. And the thing is, as well, this is flat damage, not like Scary or Fierce. It doesn't lower enemy HP, which means it doesn't affect bosses less or anything. Good. Inversion Magnet back there as well. I'll grab that for now, I guess. Right. Just try and clear out large areas at once here. I see the boss there. I'm trying my best to stay away from him. Almost two-shotting him. It's pretty pretty nuts. Uh, I think we'll definitely take Tough Shell in this scenario. Yeah, this, this thing's just absolutely god-tier as a starting weapon. I'm not sure if it's the best golden weapon, but it's definitely one of. God, the rats are so hard to kill, man. Okay. We are through. Um, 
Open mind, we got open mind here. Oh, we don't have a screwdriver on this run though, so. I mean, open mind's still good though. I still like it. I can't what the rats do on the inverted version of this floor. Nothing crazy, is it? They're just faster. There's nothing up there, good. Lightning on this thing, maybe. See how that goes. Micro machine gun. I don't know why micro machine gun's quality zero, you know. Um, could do thrown, but I think we're going to go with metabolism, though, for that every third hit is negated. Okay, we did actually get to YVs here with their... Uh... Honestly, what the fuck? Ugh. Man, I'm sick of things being able to one-shot me, man. I know that I'm uh, I'm playing on double damage, so it's expected, but God. Get a good run going, you just get one shot by something. Man. It's depressing. <laughs> it's depressing is what it is. I'm taking this this time, I'm not getting one shot again. We will have a good run here. We will loop. I've, I've not been looping much recently, but I've been trying something new, and I think while, while it's not currently working, it will eventually start working in my favor. You need to also remember that I can easily hop out the way of shots. Oh yeah, we need ecstatic fists. It makes the damage so much higher on this thing. Um, yeah, Exact Fists is just, is too good on this thing. The damage is just too good with Fists. Is that it? That's it. Cool. That plus scarier face, I think, is going to make this this weapon absolutely unbelievable in terms of damage output. Yeah, we are wrecking everything. Just get the car gone, please. Thank you. So much ammo wasted on trying to destroy that car just then. Toxic Launcher once again, no thank you. Um, second Stomach's probably a good idea here. Ooh, I did not expect that guy to hit me there. Second Stomach there puts us back up to max HP, lovely. Oh my god, man. Some of these shots are getting in there. Oh, what the fuck? No, no! I didn't even fucking see that guy! I was so blinded from, from like, the enemies in front of me, I didn't even see him. Oh, man. This is frustrating, but I will not, I will not let this idea go. I do, I do like playing on my earn impose hard mode. I, I am actually supposed to be playing hard mode this episode, I just completely forgot. But hey, uh... Um, Alkaline Saliva maybe could be good. I want to get the full damage setup going on. Ecstatic Fist, Scarier Face, and what's the other one? I can't remember what the other one's called now. Um, Puffy Cheeks, yeah, I'll go with that.
Okay. We're in a bit of an odd position right now, but... We'll be able to kill the boss fairly easily. Where is the boss, anyways, actually? Bomb Lobber. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'll take that, I'll take that. There you go. Up to level 4 on the first three stages is pretty amazing. None of my uh, items of thingy have come up yet though. Euphoria maybe? Try that out. Get away from me rats. I will not have you ruin this. A little left assassin. A few rats back there. Is that it? Yes it is. Pizza time. Let's go. Are they all just back here? Why do they do they, they all get stuck like that? <laughs> the entire stage just gets stuck. Ecstatic fists, there you go, there's that at least. I'm a little scared for this stage, to be honest. I think this with double damage could be uh, quite spicy. Remember to try and teleport out the way if we can. This is that jump that he does, it's just insane. How much damage does uh, this guy take? Not actually as much as I thought with this gun. Definitely get out of here, you. Okay. Level 7 already. We definitely need to get rid of this as soon as possible. Throw him, but... Bouncy fat could be interesting, but it also sounds really, really risky. Scarier face, there you go. Right, this is the stage where we, we need rid of uh, we need rid of our thingies, our crown. Otherwise, things are going to get a bit too sketchy. I'm, I'm focusing so hard, so I apologize for the commentary is a little more lacking than normal, but I really want to make this work. And it's taking immense focus. Sticky grenade revolver? Kind of an interesting one. Don't think we need it there. Right, still no thingy yet. A throw and vault. Right, these laser guys can wreck us, so. Uh... I always forget they fire fireballs as well. There you go, we got one. That was really close, I kind of teleported wrong there. Okay, through here we go. Right, we can change off of our crown now. Good. Try and not die to this guy. Good. Right, what crown do we go for now? Um, yeah, let's go with that one. Go with that. Careful, these little fire spewer boys. Right, keep our distance here, try and take out everything in the stage before the boss spawns. Oh, the boss has already spawned, doesn't matter. Okay, to be fair, actually, we did kill everything, that's good. I love the way I'm fighting a, a guy that's bathing in lava with a fire weapon and it's doing, like, amazing damage. Beautiful stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I've got this shotgun lance as well, which I'm not exactly sure how good it'll be. With that damage setup though, pretty much I think we can make any weapon work pretty effectively. Yeah. Careful of the teapot boys. 
They are a big threat for us. Heavy pop rifle sounds beautiful. I think I'll take that. Okay. Yeah, this is this is do this is doing as well, this. So there's a policeman up there. I don't know what variety, but I don't want to find out. What we got here? Plasma rifle. It's a little bit easier to kill some of these enemies with this weapon. Okay. Triple blood. Plasma rifle. Seeker shotgun. Bouncer laser pistol. Bouncer laser pistol. Maybe give it that a go. Seems interesting enough, especially if we can get a mute for it. Hello, Catman. You're always a pain in my ass. Keep that goddamn laser away from me. I really don't know the best way to fight you, to be honest. You just fire so many goddamn shots. We've got to be nearly dead. There goes. It's gonna say that was taking forever. <laughs> got to be on the brink of death there. Okay, big dog dead. Get him out of here. Tried to kill that little dude, but he wouldn't die. Okay, this thing can this thing can slap if it wants to. Yeah, this thing's good. <laughs> Imagine this with the thing that increases energy weapon damage. My god, it could be amazing. It's very good with puffy cheeks, I'll say that. Being able to get that extra damage off off the bat is really nice. Oh, we opened a big chest here. Is there anything that we want? Heavy flare gun. Hello. That's just a regular flare gun with nothing else on it, so... Heavy flare gun could be what we what we need now. I think what's so heavy about it? What's... Or is it just... A, I think it's just a, a flare gun that's also explosive, maybe? Is that what I'm seeing? This, this thing's so good, man. Bounce a laser rifle. Laser uh, pistol, even. That was close. Beautiful. Ah, I like that ammo. Um. Yeah, there you go. I'm taking that just in case. Hyper Gatling Bazooka. Oh my god. Mega Laser Pistol. I think bouncers could be better. Right, let's try this out. See how this goes. Imagine this weapon on Elementor as well. This would be really good. Give this a go. <gasps> oh. So fucking stupid of me. I'm so bad at this game sometimes. I could have looped there. It could have been beautiful. That got the best of me. I'll right, we'll do one more run. One more ring around the rosy. I just need to be way more careful. I'm, I'm way too gung ho in this game. I just just run at things. But I like that bouncer laser pistol. I want that again. I need to do a very good amount of damage. Take that. Nice. 
I definitely want Ecstatic Fist. I think I should just value Ecstatic Fists way more than I currently do. It's it's better than um better than Scary of Face by a good bit. So obviously it's con conditional, so it's not always going to work. But we do have to make sure we stay at high HP for it to be active. But at max HP, which we are at a fair amount, it's very very good. Oh lord, what have I stepped into here? Frost is- Frost plus fire! I like it, it seems like it could be good. Right, where's the boss actually at here? He's got explosive shots, so... Do you know what? He's got explosive shots, so I was gonna say don't get too close. What I actually ended up doing there is I just teleported directly into his line of fire. Because I pressed the wrong button. So we'll do one more, because that one was pathetic. Basically a repeat of the last one there. Scary of Face, thank you. Yeah, Scary of Face has hard to quantify, because... Um, actually, does, does Scary Face doesn't actually do what it used to do anymore, does it? It just, like, overlays the next amount of damage back onto the previous enemy. So maybe it's not as good as I thought it was. Yeah, I don't think Scary Fist... Was, uh, some excess damage transfers to the next damage you deal. Yeah, so it doesn't do what I thought it does, because it, it, it's been changed from vanilla. But still. This is the other one I was looking for. 25% less enemy HP. I'm going to exit still. I'm going I'm to stick with the, the double damage still. I can do it. A morph in there as well. Oh my god, there's so many of these guys. Where they all come from? So what I gotta do is use my teleport to get out of the way of big gunfire like that. Kind of works if we uh, if we do it, time it right. It's a little tricky to do, but. Okay, beautiful stuff. Level five as well. Okay, we've got we've got the the mighty three right now. We've got the mighty three. This is like the most damage we can possibly deal <laughs> at maximum HP with scary face with glass arm. It's kind of nutty. Okay, through here we go. Very, very scared about this. This is very much going to be a stand back as much as humanly possible sort of deal here. Try to get the rads where we can, but honestly don't worry about it that much. <laughs> Is that all of that done? Cool. Can we actually get through here? Is there not going to be enough rads to activate it? Ah, it's not. That's sad. Get blood on there going. Sad times, because I really wanted to get rid of this crown at this point, but oh well. Right, beautiful stuff. Oh my god! Someone just fired an explosive shot. There's a sniper down there. Fire explosive shots in. Oh, there's also a mini missile there. I'm so fucked here, aren't I? 
Mini missile, please go away. I can add flame onto my flame. Why not? <laughs> Get some flame on my flame. Um, we really need some protection. Bouncy fat's too risky, though. Hypersomnia is kind of protection. Yeah, this, this damage is pretty insane. Straight on through. See the inverted land. This is the frozen area. Oh god, and electric apparently as well. Fuck, I forgot about this. Oh my god, this is nuts. There's a guy behind me, isn't there? Oh god, I got hit there. That's so bad. Oh, you fucking shit. Anyways, we're going to leave it there because I'm playing terribly. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.